Good morning from Ojinaga, Mexico. It's my first day in Mexico. I'm excited. Phew, yeah, I um, slept in a little bit more today because the sun rises until 7.45 and I had a crazy long day yesterday and it's cold and it's typically foggy in the morning and so I figured, man, I'm just going to stay in bed a little bit longer and plus I don't think my room has um, heat. I think there's an air conditioner for like cool, but so it was cold. I mean, it's down, down to like the 30s last night. So I was hunkered down in bed and didn't want to get out of bed, but I feel good now. I'm going to go try to find a cup of coffee and get on the road. And I've been looking at the maps and I think, you know, I want to get back on, I want to get on the back roads, you know, not on the highway. So I'm going to try out some smaller roads today, which could mean dirt, which I've never done before. And so that should be a wild experience and just try to try to take it slow and see what happens. going to be pretty good day, I think. And uh, the sun is out. Let's see what it looks like outside. Wow, it is chilly out there. It's definitely chilly. Okay. More to come. So here's my Mexico map. I'll show you on the map where I'm trying to go and stuff. Um, here is San Antonio, where I was. And I took this road, Route 90, all the way over to right there, Del Rio. And then I took 90 all the way up. all the way up, all the way up to over to here to Marfa and then straight down to Marfa and this is where I am right now in Oshinaga. I think now I'm going to go to Camargo. Um, this road right here I understand is a toll road so I don't really want to take that. I was thinking of taking some back roads through here but I think they empty out onto the toll road so I don't really want to do that. So this road here which says 18 on this map but I believe is actually 67 now continuation of this Route 67 that I came down on from Marfa, I will take that and I will go down to Camargo. And I think that's about 190 miles. Um, I would like to go to Peral, but that's about another 50 or 60 miles. So maybe if I feel ambitious, I'll do that, but I'm not really feeling ambitious. I'm kind of tired. It's freezing cold out. So I'm thinking of coming down this and going to Camargo and I may end up staying there for a couple days. Or maybe I'll go on to Peral and stay there. But anyway, that's the route for today. Hopefully it gets a little bit warmer as I go further south because it is bitter cold outside, like no joke. So that's it. And I'm going to get packed up soon and get on the road. On the road and heading to get some gas. I think it's wise to institute a policy of always get gas when you can at the beginning of the day. So I'm going to load up on some gas finalize my map, heading for Camargo. Feeling pretty good about it. It's turned into a rather beautiful day. Very pleased about that. Puedo usar uh, crédito, tarjeta de crédito. Tarjeta, sí. Sí. Agarró tarjeta. Visa. Sí. Sí. Bueno. I got gas, I got money. I understand the exchange rate now. It's about 20 pesos to the dollar, or at least that's what I got. I'm not sure if that's good, but that's what we're working with right now. So getting on the road, seeing what happens. Heading down Route 67, 
Highway 67. And yeah, just ready to get into a routine. I'm not in any kind of routine. I'm, you know, just learning the exchange rate, just trying to get some Spanish chops back. So feeling very flustered, but that's okay. I'll get settled in shortly and feel more comfortable. So it's warming up. I have my merino wool layer on, which I probably no longer need. So I'm gonna be kind of hot, whatever. Onward and upward. Camargo, a la izquierda. Hola. around here are definitely interesting so you got to pay attention and traffic laws might be optional so there's another thing Ojinaga, Mexico stopping place. I thought, I hoped I would pass more little uh, lunch kind of spots or little tiny little towns or something to stop in. I haven't passed anything yet. I've ridden about 70 or 80 miles, so that's cool, making progress. I'm enjoying the ride, really enjoying it. Check it out. Beautiful day, I'm totally comfortable. It's in the 70s. Life is good. 
cruising along happily. I think all these bushes along the side of the road, if you can see all the white specks are cotton. There's, it appears to be cotton to me. So I'm gonna take a little break here, looking for lunch. I'm hungry, but nothing to be found yet. So I'm gonna turn off the bike, get off for a minute and stretch out and get ready to roll again. Looks like we're going up into the hills. out some cool plants I'm just outside Camargo so stopped for a quick minute I've had a bug flying around inside my visor again and it's driving me crazy so I had to pull over and I think the GoPro froze up so I just reset the GoPro because I'd like to have it on for entering Camargo so I think we're only less than 10 miles. I gotta switch over to kilometers. Oh, actually, yeah, like 10 kilometers outside of Camargo. So excited to get in there and get some lunch. All right, let's get her going. This is Camargo. Here it is. Welcome to Camargo. I'm looking for a hotel. I'm following some now for Los Nobles. Check that out.
cargo. Rather need of. Check out Los Nogales. Hola, buenas. Estoy buscando para una habitación anoche. Sí, señor. Uh, ¿Cuánto cuesta? Eh, con una, la más económica, 750 pesos. Ok. Con una cama king size, le cuesta 1050 pesos. No, la más económica. Oh, okay. Por favor. Ya tiene la habitación 112 listas. Nada más, ¿está en motocicleta? Sí, uh, ¿tienes un uh, una lugar uh, privado o seguridad? No. 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 <laughs> no. Uh, ¿Solamente en el. ahí? Sí, pues nada más ahí. No comprendo, ¿te. Sí. solamente ahí? Solamente ahí. Sí. Sí. Ok. ¿Es ok? Uh, ¿Qué piensas? Eh. Pues una de esas, una de 8.50 con dos camas para que esté ahí luego. Sí, ah. Aquí luego. Yo un check out. Uh, ¿Qué? Uh, da, da room. Sí. Da 8.50, two beds. Sí. Da, da, esto, da garage. ¿Es privado? No, 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 privado no, pero tú estás ahí. My room. Sí. And your stop. Your cycle to... ¿Es ok? Sí, I mean... Uh, okay. Sí. Ya tiene la habitación 106 lista. A la 103. La voy a rentar. Voy a rentar la habitación 103. ¿Cuál es su nombre? ¿Es Jorge. 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 McManus. M C M A. M A. M M C M A. Mac. Sí. M A N U S. McManus. Sí. One night? Sí, solamente uno. One night. Sí.
gracias. This is my little room in Camargo at Los Nogales. And not bad. Not bad at all. I'm starving. I'm gonna go out and look for some food and who knows, maybe I'll stay here another night tomorrow because I kind of like it and I got stuff to do and I'd like to just kind of get settled in. So let's go outside and see what's happening. Day two in Camargo, heading out to find some lunch, take some pictures, Fuji X100V and uh, cold, chilly, but the sun's out and it's feeling nice, warming up now. Had a good night in the hotel. It's right on the street. And it's kind of a busy parking lot, so it was a little bit noisy, but whatever, that's all cool. Um, yeah, hungry, looking for some good food, looking to take some cool pictures. Here's the bike. That's my room over there, number 103. Heading out. Police are nearby too, so that's cool. Catch you later. All right, I'm gonna try some street food. Burrito or gordita on the street, right across the street. The town is bustling with activity. There's a lot happening. Tasty lunch, a couple gorditas with my new friend who I think was making some jokes at my expense. <laughs> but that's all good. Hola de Camargos. Hola. <laughs> okay, onward we go. Gracias. Here's one of the uh, center squares. Pretty cool.
Heading out to find some dinner, although it's kind of slim pickings out there, but there might be a place uh, right next door that I didn't try last night because it's got all curtains in the window and I can't see, really see what's going on in there, but I think someone said that it's good, so I might check that out. Had a pretty good day today. Walked around, had a good lunch, was made fun of by this woman at her gordita stand and whatever, good times. Uh, had some good picture taking strolls, learned a little bit more about my Fuji X100V and got a good amount done in my room here. Just been working on videos for a few hours and you can see been sitting in bed with the laptop, laptopping it up. Feeling pretty good. Gonna head to Peral tomorrow, Hidalgo Peral, and we'll fire up the camera for that venture. So, uh, dinner time now, and we'll be back in the morning, getting on the bike. It's gonna be cold. It's gonna be like 30 out, I think. It's gonna be crazy. I'm probably not gonna leave early. Leaving at 10, probably. So, buenas noches from Camargo, Mexico. Bye. <laughs>